Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Monica Girl. Oh my gosh, so I'm taking this LA Girl concealer. Oh my god. So I used an LA Girl concealer, and now I'm using the ColourPop Fem Rose palette. I'm not sure which shade it is, but I'm gonna go ahead and put that shade up in the crease. Go ahead and do a patting motion. Um, I am gonna put the shades on the screen, so don't worry. Now I'm going to go ahead and take a blending brush and I'm going to go ahead and blend this eyeshadow together to get like a little, not even a little, a flawless blended look. Does that make sense maybe? Kind of? I don't know. Now I'm going to go ahead and take this other really pretty shade and I'm going to go ahead and apply it on the outer corner of my eye using dabbing motions and I'm going to go ahead and pick up the same shade and put it in the inner corner of my eye. I am trying to achieve a halo eye effect. Now I'm going to go ahead and take this concealer brush, not a concealer brush, an e.l.f. crease brush and I'm going to go ahead and connect both of the colors together from point A to point B. So from one corner to another. And I just want to blend that out or in. I just want to blend it, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and wet this flat brush using my Mario setting spray and I'm going to go ahead and dip into the shimmery shade and I'm going to go ahead and apply it in the center of my eyelid. Obviously, yes girl, I know it looked good. Obviously we're trying to achieve that halo eye effect so I want to apply it on the middle of my eye where there was no product and I'm going to go ahead and dip back into that really pretty shade and I'm going to apply it on my inner corner and in my outer corner just so I can get like a flawless look. So it's not like just like a straight up rectangle block looking thing on my eyelid and I want to blend that in so I'm gonna like do like a little like sweeping motion dabbing kind of thingy I guess. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take my favorite white eyeliner with my favorite what's it called angle brush from Coastal Sense. Hello hit me up please and what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go ahead and I forgot what that is follow the curve of my natural eye and just kind of like burp. <coughs> excuse me ASMR. but yeah so I just want to follow that curve and I'm gonna apply it on my other eye as well yes girl you look cute hello yes now I'm gonna go ahead and dip back into those two shades that I've been using and I want to apply it on my lower lash line because you know we can't neglect the lower lash line it just makes the look really pretty and it does connect so yes and now I'm gonna go ahead and take my what's it called pencil eyeliner gel eyeliner pencil from Smashbox is and this is in the shade fishnet and I'm gonna go ahead and apply it on my tight line yeah, and my lower lash line. So like my upper lash line and my lower lash line, but the inside of my lash line, like, does that make sense? So now I'm gonna go ahead and take my ColourPop lip primer. And I actually really do like this just for the fact that not only does it like smooth your lips, it like fills in like the little cracks. Cause you know, I don't have lip fillers or lip injections. I don't know, whatever. And it's just a really nice canvas. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take color a ColourPop Ultra Blotted Lip and this is in the shade Satin and I'm gonna go ahead and just like apply this all over my lips. So yes, here's the finished completed look. Does that make sense? So this is the end of the video. Let me know what you guys thought on the voiceover, I guess. I know it probably sucks, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!